Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Bootramp, looking back to another Boom Beach video. So it's time to attack the Mega Crab Stage 41, and the base is totally awesome and insane. I want to show you guys how hard it is, and I've been thinking like uh, for a long time now what kind of troops I should use or combo I should attack with, and I figure out tanks and scorcher is going to be the best thing. I was also considering heavies and zookas for a fast nuke down at the start. So alright, let's tap on the crab and let's scout it. Now I do have like three available attacks on this uh, base right here, and as you see, uh, I can only drop my troops on the left side here, south left side, and there's tons of mortars, tons of rocket launchers, there's two boom cannons stacked up together here, we do have laser beam on the right side, that means it's gonna be a problem for me using the camos, heavies and zookas, riflemen and zookas, Pretty much all of that uh, swarm swarm tactic is going to be really, really hard. Uh, but Heavis and Zookas would definitely uh, do a uh, massive destruction on the base. But I do think that the tanks and the Scorcher will be going further into this base, you guys. Alrighty, so... Rocket launcher at the start here. I'm not gonna be that worried of the rocket launchers on uh, uh, Either the laser laser beam is not gonna be a problem The only problem here is gonna be the boosted up boom cannon the boom cannon and the doom cannon behind there when I'm using this combo So okay, uh, I'm super ready I do have uh, two boats or two landing craft with scorchers and the rest is tanks and I'm totally boosted up 10x uh, Masterpieces not masterpiece, but statues boosted up. So we're gonna go in and attack and let's see what kind of destruction we can do you guys alrighty so we're already attacking the base right now and I'm thinking like I want to start by taking down the boom cannon behind here I think that's a good idea so I'm tossing barrages on the boom cannon and I'm gonna be following up with artillery shell to nuke that boom cannon down so one two and three artillery shells that is more than enough and of course that our uh, rocket launcher right there uh, have like a person of life. I don't know if the uh, critters are able to take it down. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna be wasting my 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 uh, critters on that because uh, there's slightly a chance I won't be able to take down the rocket launcher by tossing it out. And I need the GBE uh, to deploy my my scorcher and tanks, bros. Okay, so it's time to drop it out, I guess. So I think like I want to drop out scorcher on the left, and rest of the tanks are gonna be dropped on the right. So dropping out, and dropping out. Putting a shock on the boom cannons because we do not want to face the boom cannons wrath. Uh, I think like I'm gonna be working on the should it be the boom cannon, you guys. All right, boom cannon working on the boom cannon. Tossing artillery shells right now on that um boom cannon, and as you see, you got like a person of life. Please, oh man, it's targeting me. Please take it down. Take it down. I still have my scorches alive. That's good. That's all good. Alright, from this spot right here, I'm gonna be flaring my troops to the left because I don't want to face the doom cannon there. Putting a, uh, a smoke screen to cover up my uh, uh, scorcher. There we go. Repositioning all of my troops to the left. And I want to get like the rocket launcher on the left there before I flare back to the uh, south side or, or, or south right side of the base. We're gonna be keeping on tossing like a smoke screen, I guess. Do I need a smoke screen? Yeah, I'll toss a smoke screen just to be sure I'm perfectly covered. So right now we're heading over to the laser beam flamethrowers and uh, I'm tasting a lot of pain, you guys. So look at this, tossing a medkit, trying to just heal up the scorchers. Uh, one single health it does actually count. Uh, a second you will actually survive for a second longer. So it's all about surviving as long as you can uh, when you're playing Boom Beach, you guys. All right, working on the sniper tower. And I'm guessing like I should be working on the rocket launcher, you guys. I'm gonna be working on the rocket launcher. Shocking! Wow, that was like one shot from the uh, the doom cannon right there. Holy moly, that was totally insane. Toss your clear box to distract the doom cannon. Hopefully, it will distract the doom cannon. Uh, I'm definitely gonna keep it on shocking the rocket launcher because the rocket launchers right now are doing tons of damage. Uh, tosses of critters to prevent some damage from attacks. Hopefully you can do more damage on the rocket launchers and look at this. Come on, come on, come on, more damage you guys. Oh my gosh. Alright, so we're gonna be keeping a rock in your bros. Look at this, shocking the doom cannon once again, working on the uh, the uh, rocket launchers. Or maybe I should rock down that uh what do you call it? The laser beam. Now I won't be having enough power to rock down the laser beam. Come on, tanks. It's four of you guys. 
and now it's three of you guys. Just a bit more damage so we can save the GBE on the next attempt. Alright, so I lost the last tank there, and that was the first attack, lost all of my Scorches and the tanks. We have two attacks remaining here, guys. Let's rock and roll. Alright, so we're going to be scouting the base, and now I'm going to be analyzing the base on what kind of troops I should use on the next one. So should I keep using the Scorcher and the tanks in this one? I'm not really sure about that, because I could just shock the rocket launcher and go totally banana on, on the rocket launchers with my heavy Zookas. What do you guys think? Um, well, I could use the tanks to scorch once again. I'm switching my opinions uh, more than twice every second, guys, because uh, I have no idea right now. Should I go for the left? Should I go for the right? Maybe I should be using Scorches again. Maybe. If I could rock down the uh, Doom Cannon, I could rush down uh, the Rocket Launchers and basically take out the Shield Generators and totally take down uh, the the mega core with heavy sensu because actually uh finish it with heavy sensu because i don't know you guys but that is my biggest plan right now okay i'm gonna be using scorches attacks once again maybe it's a good thing uh because the, there's a lot of rocket launchers there i can just take down the doom cannon with the uh barrages and yeah let's use it guys let's go for it I do believe that's going to be the best tactic, so let's go in on the Mega Crab Stage 41. And as you see, this base is totally insane. It is totally insane, you guys. So the lag is real. Hashtag lag, guys. Okay, there we go. It's, it lo it's, it's loaded up. Okay, a Doom Cannon. What should I do with a Doom Cannon? Seriously, because the Doom Cannon will basically one-shot my troops. I, I need to take it down, you guys. I definitely got to take it down. Uh, you got a lot of HP for sure. Um, man, I'm seriously not sure what to do here. Should I take it down with my... Nah, I gotta try to take... Oh, man. Okay, dropping out the Scorchers and the tanks. I do have like 98 GBE remaining here. Let's toss three barrages. One, two, three, four activity shells. Come on, be enough, please. Okay, okay, good. Alright, this is good, this is good. Come on, take it down. Tossing out a clear box and as you see there... The uh, Doom Cannon is doing tons of damage, you guys. Well, we got the Doom Cannon, and my my first Scorcher is actually very, very low on HP because of that nasty Doom Cannon. Alright, working on the Rocket Launchers, I'm going to be working also on the... Uh... No, I'm not going to be working on those cannons. I'm just going to be shocking them so I can move up there. Alright, we got to get the rocket launcher though. Oh my gosh, I just lost the Scorcher, guys. Holy smokes, this base is so hard. Okay, what's the plan? What is my plan? Okay, shocking. I'm shocking. Going over to the left side of the base. Uh, covering my tanks as good as I can right now with smoke screen. We got to move away from the cannons. Cannons does a lot of damage. Oh my gosh, why did, they, why did my tanks stop there? Alright, that's fine, that's fine. We're stacking up right here. Then maybe I should consider tossing like probably a medkit just to heal up a bit of health here. Yeah, I'm gonna be tossing like a uh, medkit on the tanks and the scorcher. The rocket launcher, not really that afraid of it. I'm more afraid of um huh. seriously, the, oh, man. I always like struggle on on what to do here. Gosh, all right, tossing a clear box. Then I'm tossing a clear box. Maybe I should consider taking down that mortar because that mortar is going to be bugging my troops for sure. Alright, tossing some artillery shells right now on the mortar. Oh gosh. Alright, flame thrower. Should I use flame? No. Toss a barrage. Come on, you guys. Come on. Ah. Alright, moving to the left. Moving to the left. Getting the tanks away. Getting the tanks away. Oh my gosh, that dude kind is so nasty. Holy smokes. Alright. Let's hope we can take out the flamethrower and the mortar so we can just nuke down in this base with heavy Suzukas on the last attack. So we're gonna be advancing over to Mega Crab stage 42 for sure. I cannot fail now, guys. I basically cannot fail. Let's take out that mortar. There we go. And we're just going like total berserk now. We're just going total berserk. Let's go for the berserk style. Putting a smoke screen to cover them up so they can nuke like the cannon when the smoke is gone. I, I'm not sure how much damage I will be able to do here, but it's gotta be a decent amount of damage. Come on. Okay, smoke is running out. Smoke is running out. Go for full damage. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, good. Cannon's going down. We got a cannon though. 
I'm very satisfied with that. So basically, it's just using like uh, heavies and sukus right now in the last attack. We did a sweet amount of damage. I just love using tanks and scorchers uh, when there's rocket launchers, machine guns, flamethrowers, and stuff like that. Basically, like AOE defensive buildings. Uh, it's really good to use scorches and tanks. So it's time to switch the troops over to heavies and zookas and nuke down that power uh, mega power core. Uh, building up the heavies here. Just let's just grab the heavies. And behind the heavies, we're using uh, these zookas, of course. And then we're gonna be nuking down uh, that mega crab and advancing over to level 42. So there we go. Heavies and zookas ready to attack. Um, let's see where we drop the troops. Okay, we're just dropping out the troops here. Drop it on the right side, and I guess like the best thing here is just flaring over to the HQ and shock the defensive buildings. I guess that's the best thing to do. I got like 158 GBE here, so it should be totally fine. All right, flaring on the uh, the nastiness. The nastiness is getting flared, shocking it, uh, the boom cannon as well. Look at this. All right, this is more than fine. Holy moly! All right, shocking the rocket launchers. Go go go! All right, good. Stacking up on the HQ. Oh my gosh, we cannot fail this, you guys. I cannot fail this. Where's the damage? Where is the damage? Show me the money. All right, there we go. Booyah, we just blasted down Mega Crab stage 41, you guys. And that means we're gonna be advancing over to stage 42. Wow, oh my gosh. Oh wow, I got a power powder, powder. I got like three magma shards, diamonds, prototype modules. Holy monkey, guys. The loot is real. I love this. All right, so we're going to be heading over to stage 42, and let's see what's up. I do have, like, attack uh, available. Let's see what's up here. Okay. Whoa, look at that base, you guys. Sniper towers all over the place. Shock blasters. Oh, wow. The shield generators on the left side. Oh man, I'm gonna be bringing some massive destruction upon this base for sure. Uh, I, I'm seriously considering like, should I take out the blasters? And should I use like heavies and zookas here? Is that is that the best thing to use? Basically, there's like no shock launcher that's bugging my troops. The rocket launcher is far up there. It's pretty far up there. I don't think it's gonna be any problem at all. Oh man. Should I take out the blasters or should I take out? It's always so hard like to analyze the base and see where you're gonna be attacking guys. It's always a big question. Okay, uh, laser beam. Of course that's a problem. Of course laser beam is a problem. And I'm also thinking like maybe I should use a uh, rifleman here. I maybe will be getting further by using rifleman. I'm, I'm not sure you guys, but I guess like it's the best thing to do. The blaster, oh, man, I'm seriously not sure where should I drop my troops. Left, there's a doom cannon right there. Rocket launcher. Okay, the laser beam is gonna be a bit of a problem here. That's the, gonna be the only threat. So I'm guessing I'm gonna be nuking that. The mortars are not really afraid of the mortars. I don't that I don't think that's gonna be any problem at all. I will be able to crush on this base for sure. Okay, I do have a plan. The blaster should go also because that's going to be stopping my troops. Holy smokes. What to do, you guys? What to do? 47, 42,000, 47,000 health. I guess like it's better to just attack the uh, man. All right, let's go. I'm building up the heavies and then I'm going to be nuking down the laser beam up there. I think that's the best thing to do and just go straight for the HQ. All right, let's grab the awesomeness, guys. There we go. And there's also like, I'm also considering like, should I use Rifleman? Oh man, should I use Rifleman? Is that a better thing to do? All right, I want to scout it once again. I might change my heavies over to Rifleman, you guys. I might change my heavies to Rifleman. All right, the blaster is going to be a bit of a problem. Huh, shock launchers, heavies. Oh, there's so many sniper towers there. Oh man, all right. No, yes, no, yes, sniper tower, yes, no. <sighs> I'm actually using, I'm using, I'm using the, uh, the rifleman, you guys. I'm using rifleman. It's better to use rifleman here, I think. I'm going for it, I'm going for it, seriously. Alright, let's grab the rifleman, you guys. 
Changing the heavies over to Rifleman, I do believe using the Rifleman is going to be a better thing to do here. 48 diamonds, let's go in. I'm ready for you, bro. I'm ready for you, buddy. Alright, let's go in here. And let's do some massive destruction. Okay. Should I toss a critter first? Yeah, critter first. Rifleman out. Zuka's coming out as well. Let's go for this, guys. Come on. Come on. The blaster is definitely going to be shocking my troops very, very soon, but we're doing massive damage right now against this base. I want to work on the laser beam up here. One, two, three, one, two, three, four of the shells. I hope I, I'm going to be doing some massive damage right now. That shock blaster, seriously? Okay, I'm shocking it. I'm shocking it. One, two. Arterial shells should be enough to take out that laser beam. Yes, it was enough. Good. So maybe we will be able to take out the blaster. Seriously, if we can take down the blaster, it's going to be a good thing. It's going to be a good thing for sure. All right. Wow. A lot of, a lot of boom cannons. Holy smokes. All right. Shock the blaster once again. And we're going to shock the mortars as well. Come on, your bros. Come on, your bros. Rocking down the mortars, trying to do as much damage as I can on the mortars here. Go, go, go. Oh man, this is sweet. This is absolutely sweet. Alright, flare my troops over to the left side here. Oh gosh, I'm getting shocked. I'm getting shocked. Get away, get away, get away, get away. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh man, what should I do here? Maybe I should drop it like... Yeah, I'll, I'll drop out some clear boxes. Let's go for it. But it's a quarter box is just to assist the Zookas for like some seconds here because the rocket launcher is bugging my troops. And there we go, working on the cannons. And it seems like my power is not enough to drop down the base. But we definitely did a lot of damage to this dude right here. I do believe um, I will be able to drop down this base on the second attack. So that's everything for today. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And leave a like or double like up. And comment down below. I'll try to reach out to you guys as soon as possible. Keep on booming and see you guys there. Goodbye. Boom.